hello everyone welcome to the channel in this video we shall do another number pattern question as you can see in the slide this is the question that we will be solving so as you can observe we have a pattern where 1 1 2 1 the 2 is missing 3 1 2 and 3 are missing 4 and 1 2 3 4 5 so this is basically a simple triangle question that we had solved earlier with these numbers missing like it's forming a triangle but as if the num numbers inside the triangle are missing so how to solve this problem so whenever you are approaching such a problem always think of breaking down the problem so what is happening here in the first case we have the entire triangle like assume we have the numbers here also like we have 1 1 2 1 2 3 1 2 3 4 then 1 2 3 4 5 so this thing can be done we know how to do now we have to find out the condition so such that that we will remove this and this area from the pattern so let us first code it with all the numbers present in it let us define a function def star n for i in range of 1 to n plus 1 for j in range of 1 to i plus 1 print the value of j comma and then finally again print for new line and here star we will print from 1 to 5 so we had done this earlier in a previous video and let us just to remind this for loop is to go through the lines and this is to print the pattern 1 1 2 1 2 3 through each line so this helps us to go to the required line and this helps us to print the values in that given line so if we do this it is printing 1 1 2 1 2 3 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 5 so we have got this what we now need is to remove the 2 from 1 2 3 and 2 3 from 1 2 3 4 so when we look at this problem we can observe that whenever we are at this line that line equals to n so whenever we are in the fifth line if n is 5 whenever suppose we are in the tenth line if n is 10 we have to print the entire pattern else what we have to do else what we are doing is that we are printing the first element that is 1 and the number that is present at i or the particular line that we are at so since we are at the third line we will print 1 and 3 if we are at the fourth line we will print 1 and 4 if we are in the second line we will print 1 and 2 so what we will do is that we will modify this existing code we are saying that if i not equals to n then we will check further that if j equal equals to 1 or j equal equals to i then print the value of j else simply print a space and if this if i now is equals to 
n then print this j statement this is it we are done so what we are basically doing is that we are introducing these conditions into the program that previously printed this whole thing we are saying that if i if we are at the line which is not equals to n if we are at the line which is not equals to n so 1 2 3 4 this is the first this is the second this is the third and this is the fourth and none of these lines are equal to n which is equals to 5 then do one thing then check if the value of j j is printing the pattern so if j is equals to 1 or j is equals to i then print the value of j else print a space now previously it printed this let us now print again run it now you are getting the triangle with the required appropriate shape let us now increase it to 8 as you can see as we are increasing the value so the corresponding value is printed i hope this gives you an idea as to how to exactly solve this question always try to break down the problem into pieces and try to solve them it will be helpful thank you